Hello everyone, this is Inayat Mir with my Linux video. So this video will show you how to join a domain. First, I am show, showing you my host name and also uh, present working directory and who am I, the way I log in. Now, I don't want to use my user account which has no right. So if you want to switch from user account to root account, you have to use your uh, super user credentials command su space hyphen then you have to use your root password then under root password you can see that what files or folders or directories you have with what type of rights so we will discuss about the rights in some other videos first you see under my domain ny1.com I don't have my Linux machine. So what we're going to do here first, we all have to know that we need to add this yum package. This is actually a pre joining uh, package, which you have to run on the machine. If you don't have uh, this already available on your machine, if you built a new machine, in my previous video, which I posted a few months ago, uh, where I showed you for uh, all steps for installation and configuration of the new operating system. So here I am going to install this package and also on the way while the package is being installed, we will discuss a couple of commands or about couple of commands which I will show you actually as a lab in my future videos. Few of the commands we will see uh, in my next video and a few of them I will add in the series. For example, uh, if you want to add a text to the file, you can use echo command. So your text goes right as I mentioned here, you can put a file name. Once you want to add a text with one line or with two lines, you can follow those a greater than sign. One time greater than sign and two time for appending an existing file. So CP as it names uh, shows that means copy. So you can use CP for the copy command and you can use CAT concatenate. We will also discuss about user accounts, groups, Linux text editor, about the root account and about putty versus graphical user interface. Most likely I will show you putty when we use actually uh, labs connecting from a windows environment to your linux environment so creating a user creating a group adding a user into a group is a very simple and straight forward work so these all things i'm showing you because i also want you to see at the back end how this package is being installed. So that's how this will go. So the timing, the way you see almost is showing me that we are almost done. So this package is in the process of last few files. So we have 27 of 62, 28 of 62, and this will actually move on a little more quicker now 62 of 62 now verifying that so actually we are ready now to join the domain so you have to be very careful to look at my active directory and some configuration file so this is a network management tool user interface command where you can go and i have done it already just I am showing you here that you can go and edit your IP address, edit your host name, and then you can go exit from this command. So command is shown on the top left side, NMTUI, 
So you have seen my uh, previous video where I did installation of uh, CentOS or CentOS operating system Linux and also Ubuntu. So I have done those all videos previously. If you did not watch those videos, you simply can go back and search. So here I am showing you what IP was configured, what host name was configured, host name PWD and who am I are the common commands. Now I am going to use my domain joining command because uh, the most time I spent is to configure my Linux server first and installed that big package that took about 10 to 15 minutes actually. That was the installation time. During that installation, I have paused my uh, video as well several times. So here now you simply join this domain. Once you join the domain, you use the password. I used my domain administrator password. So currently I just joined the domain by using this command. Now I need to refresh my Active Directory to see my Linux SVR1 host. So now you can see uh, everything is good. Now you can move on with rebooting this computer. You have a command a lowercase reboot or you can use a GUI. So I am mentioning on the top I just joined this Linux host to ny1.com domain. So ny1.com domain is running on a Hyper-V environment on my physical server. So keep an eye on my upcoming Linux videos because uh, I will continue this Linux video series. Uh, this is all basics. So I am going from basics to little moderate to advanced level slow by slow. Here you see by default I am accepting the options for my region and my language. You can skip if you want to skip any option from here because uh, you get these options when you install the operating when you install your Linux and because we just join domain so you are going through this all again here you can see then how you logged in now who am I now you are logged in as administrator but this is not a local administrator this is a ny1.com administrator so here you can also see the profile and profile folders you also can use with uh, minus l for the list of the directories and the rights on the left side that what type of rights we have we have a read on directories or write or execute permission so uh, these are basically a complete different topics I will discuss with later on. Thank you for watching.